So no doubt Bob is very pleased indeed to be told that he's a genius, but is he? Let's have a look at the tree diagram. Okay, so we define the top 1% as a genius, so therefore the actual probability of being a genius is 0 0.1, 0 0.01, which means 0 0.99 probability is not a genius. And looking at the false positives reading to non-geniuses, if you're not a genius, 0 0.1 probability is that you are told you're a genius, and therefore 0 0.9 probability you are correctly told you're not. And there's a false negative 5% of the time here, which means that you are incorrectly told 0.05 probability that you're not a genius if you are, and 0.95 probability that you are. So to see if Bob is genuinely a genius, we have to look at this here and this here, and therefore we have that the probability that he is actually a genius, i.e. on this path here, is 0.01 times 0.95 over the two possibilities, which is 0.01 times 0.95 add 0.99 times 0.1, which equals 0.0876, which is answer B. So therefore, Bob, you actually have a less than one in 10 chance of actually being a genius.